Welcome back everyone to Old World Blues, the A to Z series in which we're playing right now, of course, as Lions' cohort, or really, the Eastern Legion. Now, I restarted at the end of last campaign. Well, maybe not restarted, but, uh, kind of went back in time. So now we're not at war with the good old Midnight Union. My god, is that difficult. The Daughters of Ecate still exist, um, uh, for some reason. I'm not sure why that changed, but it looks like the Legion is pretty much dead. The NCR is taking it over. Um, they still have, they just ended the war against them, so the NCR is looking pretty mighty and thick. Oh boy. Um, hopefully they don't come for us, but instead of going to war with the Midnight Union, we've gone to war with the Provisional Republic of Texas, and it looks like we're doing okay so far. Vertebrate schematics once again, alright then. Oh. And also we did not go to war with Oklahoma just because we were struggling very hard earlier, and uh, yeah. We were struggling very, 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 very much, so we're going to see what we can do here. We seem to be doing alright overall. Um, we'll call on more divisions if we need to, but for now we're going to say no. Uh, I hope we can do well here. Of course, we are out of equipment. We don't have enough anti-tank. We don't have enough doggos. We still have 44,000 manpower, roughly. So, we're going to be working on that uh, as we do this. Uh, do that. Go down to that much. Um, support equipment, sure. Lots of doggos. Lots of planes, too. Um, we're going to work on at least two military factories on a line at a time, hopefully. As we attempt to bust our spies into Texas, as we're feeding the cohort. With the resources of New Mexico under Landis' control, he can divert slaves to rebuild the old dams and aquifers that once allowed limited farming in the land, the fallen empire. 200 years ago, a father built a store to support his family. 50 years later, that man's store had become a cheese empire, keeping the old world fed and happy. Today, all that is left of this milk based legacy is a temple, a shrine of cheese and its wired metal hands, the same that crafted the mozzarella of kings in the age of old. And I wanted to take these guys out first because eventually our technology, they will surpass us in technology and we gotta, we just gotta do it. I mean, these guys, they're probably pretty thick, pretty tough. Oh, they're out of manpower. 135 divisions max, though. Oh, whenever we get our, our guy jailed. Oh, that always helps. Uh, anything else we've got here? I'm not gonna lie, there's been a few days between this episode and the last few, so... Yeah, so if I don't seem to be caught up on everything, it's because I'm not. Powered fists are very fun. Uh, new system scare package. Best military academy. Uh, let's save our money for that. We'll do that one too. How to hunt mire lurks. More organization would be nice. I don't think we have enough from Butcher's Pete. We can. I mean, we could, um, grenades. That's all right. Powered melee weaponry. We don't really need more infantry equipment, do we? No, we got 1,700 for now. So we can probably close out of this one for now. Anything else we really need here? Science points, that doesn't really help us out too much in this campaign. Um, support equipment, more research speed perhaps, industry probably not, force core and cultural simulation, we'll keep that one open for now. We'll see what happens. So any damage that we do, they cannot replace, which is great. Now there's a ton of divisions here, but I really want this tile just so that we can at least get in there. So losses, we've lost quite a few, 5,000, we lost 11,000, of course they're finding as well, Oklahoma over here too, but they have waterways that they have to deal with, which is slightly easier for them than us to defend. Oh, obviously. Let them recover a little longer. Anything for planes? Infantry? You know what? Let's use infantry for planes. That's hills and mountains. Jungles, forests, planes, yeah. Trading lightly. Desert's good. War propaganda is nice. So we're done with all that stuff over there. Um, we can't do anything at the bottom, which kind of really sucks. Anything else we can do around here at all? Maybe not. Uh, I'll do some of this, though. That'll be good. Yeah, but it's been kind of a struggle busting session, not gonna lie, because we're not super strong. Don't get me wrong, I'd like to be stronger, but it's kind of impossible. The way the Legion, if you like to read about this, please go ahead. Boop. That's good. Um, open palm, I think we read last time. Those who submit to la the Legion shall live. Some may even come to appreciate what we do for them. And scavenge solar plants. The ancients harness the power of the sun, but the Legion does not need to challenge the gods yet. Let's tear apart their old plant and turn it to a better use. It's good. Yeah, now we're losing here, which has been a common factor for us here. Um, a lot of the time, we've just not been able to do very much. We lost 500 men for that for nothing. So, a lot of it is just us hanging out and waiting to get attacked or attacking them. So, uh, we're just going to continue building ourselves up. We actually pr probably will need to build up some supply hubs 
here and there just because of how many uh, things we've got running right now. And of course more military factories as we'll continue to do all this stuff too. Anything else around here? The Chariots of Mars, although we are far from the Temple of Two Suns and Nas, we can deploy chariots on the frontier. They'll serve us well when we drive to the seas. Let us use the road. With the consolidation of our rule east of the Rio Grande, we can afford to equip entire units with cars. Ave. And the Butcher. A Butcher's Peace. Although some question the Alliance's methods, none can deny that the lands of Under's rule become more peaceful. Gone are the Raiders and any threats to trade. For the Legion, a world of fear is better than a world of pain. Of course, we read this one last time. Series, uh, Subito Legish Minerva. Let them have their tribunals. We'll be the ones that deliver true justice behind the scenes. Subitus Lige, Lupiter. The fit will thunder across the battlefield, graced by divine winds. The rest will serve as his stepping stones. Mars, the first word to pierce the enemy trenches will be destined for eternal bliss in the great beyond. And Abuntia. For every two slaves that collapse from exhaustion, a third will have the opportunity to wield one of the finest blades this side of the Rio Grande. And gateway to the south, unfortunately for the Pecos Raiders. Or ranchers. The lands present an ideal stage and ground to strike at the heart of Mexico. And we finally made a respectable encirclement. Not great, not bad. We've lost about 10,000. We've killed off about almost 28,000, which is actually pretty good. But at this point, um, I don't think Texas has any more manpower. So that's how we can actually win here. We're relatively comparable in strength. We're definitely under them. But now they're at 89 divisions, which is fantastic. So let's go in. Oh, I forgot. We also broke their ciphers too. So... Uh, we're also spy masters of the Frumentari of the East, which is probably a good idea that we did not go with uh, Kaisar, you know. But there they go. Even some NCR divisions are in here too. They're trapped. Thank God. Destroy the NCR. NCR does not deserve to live. We are running out of manpower. We're about 20,000 manpower less than where we left off last time. We've been doing a lot of focuses, raising a lot of divisions. We're doing the focuses that gave us a more, lost 2,000 manpower in exchange for supplies and whatnot. I mean, we also demobilized a little bit too. We've got some... Uh, aces, arrow breaker, construction speed, I wouldn't mind. Archbishop dagger. More stability is okay. Recruit population. You know what? Let's go with Sheriff Boucher. Slaves be subject to your masters with all reverence, not only to those who are good and equitable, but also those who, are, who persevere. Uh, or perverse. Okay. The lands of the archdiocese were not all run by priests. Others assisted him in maintaining law and order. Even now, under the bull, some still do, albeit with the change in careers. Uh, Pedicurial conscript is not bad. I don't mind the more attack. I like the more attack, but I might go with un no undesirables. Which doesn't make too much sense lore-wise, but um, we're struggling here at this point, um, and we've got to use whatever we can to our advantage. So, look at that. Fantastic. So now they've down to 61 divisions, which is still pretty good. Don't get me wrong. Um, and they should still be fighting these guys. But now we're really pumping out even more. These divisions aren't bad. Abilities. They're 20 combat width. If, you know, they're all right. Um, with the Triori, our special forces, which are also 20 combat width. I'll uh, get rid of that one. We do want to make more divisions, but at this point... Oh, can they enter our lands that way? I hope not. That'd be quite bad for us, because these guys are what? Oh, they're all part of the Texan Economic Union. Hopefully we can defeat the Republic of Texas first. Our provisional Republic. Oh, they're 0%. Nice. Um, 52 divisions. Nice. Um, first, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much our goal here. Almost all of these things done, which is good, good, good. Oh, we can do another focus here, huh? What do we got? Oh, uh, the plunder of Lone Star. With the control of the richest town in North Texas, we can use wealth of prolificates for the glory of the Legion. Nice. Actually, how much do you have here? You're level 10 already, so it doesn't even really matter, but okay. Why not? Stones. I'll get a little more tax, not bad. Of course, we're running out of a lot of equipment here, including uh, the equipment. But at this point, I don't think they can really muster up any sort of defense. I guess they're doing the Emergency Industry Act. Makes sense, don't get me wrong, but still. At this point, it's a little bit too little too late. Uh, I guess go to Dallas. Of course, there's an open barrier there, too, but we're here to just crush the main army. Go to Fort Hood if you can. California Republic is joining the oh. Cool. Blend of Lone Star. Shoe State's looking pretty big. Mechanical tools. Um, we're doing all this so that we can eventually get cheaper coring costs. I can have precision. Ah, they're forced down through here. Which kind of sucks. Whatever. Is 
citizens concern, which is good. It gives us 20% cheaper coring costs. Uh, let's get to tribal pride. So let's go ahead and can we start coring some more things around here, maybe? Go parts of Oklahoma and whatnot. That'll help us out a little bit, right? If we move fast enough through here, we should be okay. But you never know. Austin, nice. Uh, go back and do that one. Watch out for those spies. Uh, sure. Good. These guys will die here now. Good. Ah, oh, beautiful. Well, that's some better coring costs. Some better coring costs, yes. Nice. Ooh, we're trying to break over that waterway is going to suck, so we're going to split. Split. We're going to split these guys up. You guys are going to focus here. You know what? You're going to be part of the out group, and you're going to come to Waco? I got criticized a lot for calling it Waco, but it's Waco. And couldn't do the fox, we go. Nice. And yeah, nice. Trip to their soccer, eh? Yeah, that sucks. Go all the way across. You cannot stop. Good. Spread out. Nice. So that's all good and all. As we do all this stuff, it's fine. Uh, can I buy any more stuff here? Nice. We're going to manor apple territories. We're also going to do new citizens care package because we're going to have quite a few guys here. Oh, um, I need that. Stormtroopers, good. Found expedition, pretty normal. Uh, I guess we'll do max factors. Fall of Dallas, provisional Republic of Texas. One of the largest powers in Texas is supposed to be close to overrun. The capital city of Dallas being captured by the Eastern Legion earlier today. Reportedly, their leader, Edward J. Uh, Rusk, was seen fighting alongside defending forces in the streets of the city prior to the retreat. As the brother withdraws from the capital, raiders within the territories that were active even before the ongoing conflict are now raining hell upon the caravans and settlements with the brotherhood unable. Uh, uh, to respond. Oh, look at that. Look. Uh, can the provisional Republic of Texas recover, or will Texas be under control of a new power? Texas, of course, is ours, which is great. Fantastic. And we had that one focus autocomplete. The falling star, Lone Star once faced the threat from the Legion's raiders and almost fell. What change do they have against the true forces of the Legion? Roms is dying for Earth. At long last, we found a foe worthy of Lanius. Uh, ooh. The conquest of Texas. The brother has fallen. The Alamo and the sacred temple of the Texans has been desecrated. None are left to stand against the delegate. Atlantis has planted his sword in the sea, symbolizing that Atlantis' strength reaches to the end of the world. Fantastic. Ooh, we definitely need this too. Oh god. At least do that much. Get more doggos. Way more planes. And I'll see if we can probably use go to three, go to five there. Five, uh, five, five. Nice. Um, now we're going to go to war with the Cypher Warband, probably. They should be fine. I know we took them out at the end of the last episode, but, you know, with all this stuff going on, it's been real tough trying to do this. you a pretty good-sized army. You go here. Go ahead and train if we need it. Look at that. Fantastic. Oh, hello. Who's... Oh, Imperial Mexicano is coming from them, too. Look at that. Trying to beat up the Republic of the Rio Grande. Brother versus brother. What do you expect? I expect better. Didn't quite get the trade note down there, but that's all right. So, uh, gift the two beds with a new purpose. Surely Landis deserves a bar to sing his praises. Let the two beds spread across the legion that all might know of Landis's conquest. Follow the fate of the roller girls. I love roll. I love girls. Uh, well, that sounds weird. Uh, it's strange indeed that the East was led by so many women, and it's stranger still that they fought better than many of the tribes of Arizona. We can move the roller girls by giving them access to their lost temple in Dallas, providing an ally in Texas. Yeah, maybe. And we can also demand our upper territories from these guys, too. Might as well. Can they really afford another uh, to front war? So we'll see. If not, we'll go to war with them next. How about settlements still? Political power's nice. Optimized trading, you know, whatever. We don't really need to do these anymore. It's fine. It's whatever. 
many do we get a month? 221? We need someone to fight the NCR with us. Maybe the troll warm, but they're not big enough. Huh. Huh. No, sir, don't want to see this? It's fine. Alright then. Interesting. Interesting choice. So Republic of the Rio Grande. Also, the Austin awesome Republic is by itself, which is great. But by Keats, yeah. Well. I guess I do have one or two guys here, too. Not super worried about that. I'll let the Imperial Mexicano take them out and whatnot. Organize workshops. Cool. More factory output is always handy to have. There you go. Med X. Good. Oh, are they in this faction too? Oh, whoops. Well, I can't even get over there, so it's fine. Just move in as fast as you possibly can. Sure. And now, ladies and gentlemen, don't change that channel. Let's give you an update on how those rebels against the Legion are faring. And ooh, it looks like another one has died on a cross. Truly, the, given the fate that waits all who oppose Lanius, we dare challenge his rule. And uh, coming up next, we'll have a gladiator match between two tribals. Only one of them will be worthy of the rule of the Legion. And who will it be? But first, a word from our sponsors. Perhaps it was a mistake. Sponsored bards. That's kind of cool. Sure, less training time. Sure, why not? So what's going on here? We're 1%. We've lost 5 guys. Jungle Pact. And they're all fighting the Rio Pact. Wow. 68,000 losses. Very good. Just spread out like a cancer. And gateway to the plains. We'll definitely need to do that one later. Which I think I did the last episode too, but... Sequoia is the outpost of a vast Midwestern nation. A realm, really, where an ancient battlefield rests. Let us take the springboard so that our strength may one day wash over the east. But we need the melting yard first. Ah, every bumper is a sword, every chassis is a tank, and so we grow and grow, bringing our peace to the wasteland. Yeah, pretty much. So we do need to go to where these guys next. 85 days is fine. We've got plenty of time for this stuff right now. Double pride's good. Sure. Don't let him live. Where are we at? 9%. Wow. Gloria. Good old Gloria. Glory Falls. Chemical bleaching. Nice. Oh, it is Republic of the Rio Grande. That's good. The Chichen Itza. Okay, then. Well, all I can really do is go this direction, I guess. It's fine. We'll take it over again. We just wanted all of Texas. We'll take a few more states after than that. That's fine, but we do need to go to war with probably Imperial Mexicano as well. Um, do we do all this stuff? We knock out this one here. Coordinated strike. Well, air speed is pretty good. Contact loss again, really. Uh, what with mission control? We don't. We're not very well developed on our air stuff anyway, so it's fine. Adapt rating to survive? Probably not. What organization do you actually have? 41. You guys have how much? It's way radically more. Okay, go in, guys. Benito Juarez. Are there divisions here? Oh, they're there, there too, but whatever. Let's see if they can beat up the cartel or not. Beautiful. Oh, 
Alright, well, there's that. In the meantime, we're gonna get reset up to do this as well. Special forces. There you grow, and there you go. Go back and train. So what are we missing here? Quite a few things. Infantry equipment a little bit. Fire teams. Nice. Yeah. As long as we get all Texas, that's all I care about. We're just gonna cancel that. We're gonna wait till this one's over. Um, September 29th. This will give it about a month, and then we we'll just fine. It'll be way faster than what we've got originally, um, which should be fine. Good, good. As we're just gonna continue growing our army. Oh, guess they're tired of their stuff, huh? Cool. So right now, we've not really cared about equites here too much, have we? No, we haven't. I really don't want anything that'll slow them down. It's my biggest concern. Mm, you still make more military factories, though. One, two, three, perhaps. Because when we do our focuses, I know I've quite a little bit here and there. Yeah, better resistance target. Uh, picking up the pieces them, resistance target, we don't get cores on them. Well, a few select locations we probably do. Power from one Kaiser to another. Well, he's dead, so. Vulcanization's fine. Let's grab this too. Electrify, increasing our power, good. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh, say Sequoia. Pretty small, that's alright. Yeah, this is way better. 90 days, that's what I thought it would be. It'll probably be 85 or 95. Not 85, 90, something like that. Totally fine. Naval stuff, max factories in the state. Oh, bureaucracy. We definitely do have a bureaucracy, don't we? Old world blues, nothing like it. God, I want power of May 11 This is hurting us, still. How are they not being able to take out the free fighters? I do not understand. So we'll take out all of Texas, we've got to take out Oklahoma, then we'll have to go back to uh, Colorado. Okay, which is good. So have stuff we can do down here. We got plenty enough stuff to research and whatnot. Should be good. Should be very, very, very good. Let's see. Uh are we missing oh oh yeah, biplane fighters? That'd be fantastic. Very soon we should be able to go to war. Happy uh, auto saving. And November 1st, not bad, not bad. As long as the, the NCR doesn't go to war with us, I'm sure the NCR could actually push us through because we don't have enough air superiority for anything. Uh, fire teams, yeah, fine. We'll throw more on fire teams, I guess. Corn shouldn't cost too much. 59, 20, oh, 28, we gotta go 28, 34, oh yeah, that's nice, 26, 27, oh, well, we're gonna go back to war with them, I guess, Corn in the Colorado, huh? That doesn't quite work the way we wanted to, but whatever. Um, there you go. There you go. I think that's all the waterways we got. One, two, three. Oh, there's one more down there, too. There you go. Is it you? Yeah. Get 
cancel on this. At first, I thought they canceled the alliance. I'm like, what? What's going on? Yeah, shuffle your way over there. You'll be fine. You'll be fine over the waterways and whatnot. How much manpower do they have? State of Sequoia. Only a thousand. They got a lot of divisions. It's not bad for them. Watching for spies. What percent should we sell? 18. Still not bad. Not too bad. New Vegas is downfall. Didn't think they'd last very long. What do you expect? All right. Come and take it. Come on. Come on, Sequoia. You wanted us, right? Bureaucracy's good. Come down here. And sure. Oh. Whoops. Oh, they demanded territory and they got that. Oh, okay. That's going to be a little more challenging then. All right. Well, you know what? You guys might actually get a little crushed here a little bit. That's all right. That's what we got nine here. It's fine. Oh, of course they would. If that's the case, your 32 divisions are going to go in immediately. You guys can go in too. See what you can do. You know, the more damage we can do, the better. Once they're out of that initial thousand, roughly ish, they're going to be dead, so. Well, at least we want to take that from the Sack of Warband. It makes it easier for us over there, at least. That's good. You all be fine. It's fine. It's fine. Whatever. You know, honestly, just get over here. There you go. Ta da! Easy peasy. Ooh, special forces division. Yes, please. Get down here, cut them off. Well, at least they went to war with us. Nice canneries. Houston, you are going to have a problem. Oh, okay, that was way faster than I thought it would be. As guys are, or Latinus is core, own six more nodes. All loads, all loads, all roads lead to Rome. Fantastic. What's next? Every bumper is a sword, every chest is a tank, and so we grow and grow, bring your peace to the wasteland. Absolutely. Love it. Working on it. Eighty nine's a bit much. And again, I guess we have to core it. It's not bad, Lubbock. Say it in New Vegas. Oh, look at that. Get Snyder. Why not? That'll help Oops, spread out all around here. Oh, so I guess we have Dallas' support as well. Nice. Vampire just keeps going up, you know. Melt in the yard. Fantastic. I doubt we'll be able to do this at all, but that's fine. Whatever. Cool. It's definitely better than last time. Oh, well, that should just auto bypass, but I guess not. Whatever. What are saying? Hey, we're good on infantry. Oh, look at that. 26,000 pieces of infantry equipment. Yes, please. Vehicles. You know what? We're actually using vehicles, so we're going to do this one next. Faster. Yeah, Great. International trade. I mean, we are the international. Well, not from like. Oh, there's one here. Well, I guess we have to move in really fast then, whatever. Uh, not from like Kaiserreich or Kaiser Redux, which I've not played in a long time. I'm on such an Old World Blues Fallout run right now, it's not funny. Oh, there's another opening here too, whatever. 
Do we have the cipher down here? No, we didn't even start the cipher. Okay, good to know. Northern Light Republic. Where is that? Northern Lights? Oh, look at this! Well, that's different. Oh, Sisters of Steel? No. Well, that's interesting. That's kind of cool. They want to spread out. They want Oklahoma for themselves. And then we got to be the big people and say, no, you don't deserve Oklahoma. We got a lot of caps. Thanks, Zach Warbam. Sure, why not? Sure, why not? The pass. We've been working on this entire time. I'm still going to get that. Go get a war with those guys. I don't want another uh, border with Imperial Mexicano. Um, so it probably would be best to take out the Austrian Republic next by themselves. That's probably what we should be shooting for here. Uh, well, you know, old you can do that while we're waiting for that. Uh, that. 26 is all. Oh, you know what? You know what? You guys will come down here and do this. This is a big, big border here. Special forces can deal with, honestly, trying to get Los, you guys can do that. You can come down here. Good luck. No time go on. Get rid of the planes, nice. Finesse, perceptive. Oh! Anti venom trait. That's kind of different and unique. I don't think I've seen that one before. Nice. At this point, I'm done with inspiration, although we're near the end of the campaign. I like lo uh, local leader. Uh, animal friend, but we do it. We are using dogs. We're going to go local leader because I just want to shove as much as I possibly can in these divisions. Um, Black Giver. Yeah. What else we got here? Cataphracts. It seems the old witch gave the Cherokee one last gift. Horses, like so many before them, they will be broken to the Legion's will. And with luck, my spoils will guard Kaiser and his triumph in Shady Sands. Well, I don't know about that. Oh my god, is that huge? I don't think we would be able to take them on. My god, just finish off the free fighters. What's wrong with you? I know those Mex Mexican luchadores are strong. But come on. I've been to San Marcos. Cool. So how strong is this group here? Austin Republic, Unity of Austin, thousand man power, fifty four divisions. This will be, should be easier than what we've done before. Um, for now, y'all can go right there. Please. Chariots are actually kind of tanky, thickies. Um, anything that slows down, probably, but so we're not going to do that yet. Anything over here? I always go dedicated engineers, urban planning is fine. Ah, free. And the audacious. Horses are nice. Very cool. We're not going to use them, but very cool. Oh, horses too. Urban planning, very good. Uh, vehicle stuff. You know, we've completely ignored the vehicle stuff. Recon snipers. All right. Nice. We're going to war with them after the unity of Texas. Should be nice. Been to the Alamo as well. Sure, why not? This will be the catch-all, though. For all the spare things that we need to, need to make. Yeah, we should be fine. This is more concerning up here, but it looks like we'll be more than fine. Especially compared to what they have, or they're the lack of. Oh, we're going to lose 4,000 manpower things. That's quite a bit. Um, hmm. Paulus was an incompetent fool who placed his pursuit of personal glory ahead of sound tactics. The time's come to scrub the stain on the bull's legacy. Oh, we got nice. We'll throw it on. Hurts your organization a little bit more, which really does suck, but it does boost up things a little bit more. Armor hurts, though. 
Give and take. So after them, Bayou Motors, eh, it's not really exactly Texas. 75 days isn't bad, though. Do we have the sector done? No, it was 94% done. Oh, that's close. Well, Unity. Hello? Losses. Oh, not too much, really. Not yet. Very good. Alright, you know what? There's an opening there on the other side, but if we move fast enough through here, it won't matter. Cool. Worthy foes, at last among the mutants of Texas, do we find our warriors of Ravalanius? Some of them may provide good sport, and others will have rally the Legion. Red and green have never looked so good. Automatic bottle blowers? You bunch of bottle blowers. Conveyor's nice. Dough rollers. Rolling lots of dough. Should be fine here. Scanner just found something. Hey, more attack and defense. Great. Vermont. Oh, good old Beaumont. Never again will I want to go there. Give an opportunity to literally just to slaughter them. Oh. Warms my heart. Thank you, Houston. We're looking pretty good. Our horde's looking pretty darn good, not gonna lie. Well, if that's the case, I guess body motors will be next since we're waiting for everyone else to kill themselves off here. Hey, worthy foes. The blade stood poised at Shale's throat. The mask, impassive. Blade against blade, blow for blow, Blanius has beat the super mutant warlord in submission. In a fight that would only grow in the telling. There is no shame in falling, declared the legate. Many graves in the east are filled with those who stood against me. Must I dig another? The super mutants who watched their leader's next words would debate what happened next. Was she all quiet? Or was it the loudest noise they'd ever heard yet? Welcome to the Legion. Prodigium. 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 That's awesome. Fantastic. Setting. The N. Fantastic. The cannery? No cannery around here, y'all. Old paramedics are nice. Mobile logistics are nice to have, too. Hey! Welcome aboard. Supply hub if you need it, just in case. Good. Slaying the abominations, Godless well. Mechanical aberrations of fallen legends. Putting them out of their endless torch will be the greatest kindness afforded to them in centuries. An equal in another life. I suspect I would have much to discuss with the general flesh and blood. I will not dignify mere echo with those same platitudes, though. There we go. Can I start just fighting on the clean jumpers, too? We just gotta start moving in and taking things out. They're not going to force defense. Come on, guys. It's more fun that way. Force is three. No problems here. Port Cypermolt. Cypermolt. Good. Oh, you're not even taking it? What the heck, guys? Our body motors can be taken or cypher broken, but I don't think it really matters. We do against the claim jumpers. Let them have their place in the sun, maybe. 
Looking pretty good. Of course, we will need to take out Imperial Mexicano too. How strong are they? Because they're struggling a lot. My god. Quite a few divisions. We're just about, probably still going to make a few more too as well here. So technology. Are we out of any other equipment? No. Good. Actually, for this. Horses. It's not bad. Piercing. They got a lot of organization though, which is fantastic actually. Of course, they're considered special forces. And they don't have nearly as much, 195. I think you probably get close to it. Do you have armor on you? Oh, you have enforcers on there too, that's why. There we go. Dill rollers, nice. Better division attrition. Um, telephone. There you go, why not? Mobile logistics. Mobile enforcers, of course. Oh, oh well. Don't think that's really gonna help us out too much, now, is it? Half a chocolate bar's rations. Not bad. Sure, optimize trading, because why not? Sure, why not? Curse with knowledge. Well, you lost the Legion. I've been where you were before, but you weren't the first conquered, and most certainly not the last. You're allowed to live when, the pe when you chose to pose like it. But if you can't come to terms with reality, all that is left is a painful death. Be shaped as clay and build a better future, or feed the worthy as a compost. Or as compost. Why not? We're going to build things faster, why not? Rebuild things and build things faster. You know, screw it, we'll do that too, because we can. What else we got around here? Can't quite core that stuff, which kind of sucks, but whatever. Can't even core this stuff, too. Because I'll core you. Good, 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 good. Petty criminal conscripts. Roman Diane's gonna be tough to take out, that's alright. What else do you expect? Two days left, good. Good. Good, nice guy. Let him spread out maybe a little bit. Organization, scrap trucks. I'm going to spread a little bit first. Really not a good idea using all these guys up here in the mountains of Colorado to fight like this, but whatever. Good. Sewage systems. Very nice, very nice. Definitely not lost as much as I'd like. Anything else around here? No. Yeah. Should have lost slightly. their entrenchment. Come on. Pasteurization is fine. Daily critical power gain is fine. Doing a little bit of damage, not very much, but a little bit of damage does help. You guys just force it. Yeah. 
Law enforcement. Good. Ooh. Is there only. I guess this is the one tile that they have here. I think. Well, all you and you left here. You two and you will go here. You will go here. attack us, but maybe not. Let's see if, the, if they recover first. Maybe they will, maybe they won't. So, we'll probably get, uh, use some more support. Ah, see, I knew they would do that eventually. Good. Let's save and see what happens. A lot of divisions, not a ton of manpower, but they are using robots, it's something to be aware of. And use that cipher. What can we do here? Probably pretty good. I gave those extra divisions around there too, just in case. Good. Nice. How are we doing over here? Shale. You can leave a shale for now. An XL there, huh? The wear pain train. Huh. Interesting. The wear pain train. Now, can you win by yourselves here? Real question. Happy February. Mm, you might just be able to win, perhaps. We're looking pretty good. Ah, there you go. Very nice. A 180, huh? Oof. That's a long time, is it not? You're doing great. Oh, you got to go down here, didn't you? God dang it. You're done here too. Come on, let's get out of there. That's where the salvage motorcycles go. Good, good, good. 
Cool. Yeah, I'll be, you know, working our way out of here too. Be very nice. Good, and they're gone. Good, thank God. Jesus, that took too long. Well, I think we'll might just end it there. Oh, hello. Uh, we're on both fronts here. Well, one we're up, so we'll take out a lot of Colorado, take out Diana, take out pretty much the rest of Mexico. We've done pretty darn well in this episode, I'd say. But if you enjoyed it, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you tomorrow. And we'll probably be our last episode playing as the good old Alanius' cohort, also known as now the Eastern Legion. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.